Today is November 18th, on which we commemorate Hilda, abbess of Whitby. Hilda came from a royal Anglo-Saxon family, born in the days when her people were just being converted to Christianity. In AD 625, her widowed father, King Edwin of Northumbria, married a Christian princess from Kent. Her new stepmother had brought with her Bishop Paulinus, and together their efforts resulted in the conversion of Edwin and his family who were all baptized together on Easter Day in 627. When Edwin was killed in battle and pagans overran his kingdom, Hilda fled with Paulinus and her stepmother back to Kent. At age 33, Hilda answered the call of Bishop Aidan of Lindisfarne to return to Northumbria and found a convent. An energetic administrator, Hilda soon oversaw a thriving double monastery for men and women at Whitby, she became renowned for her wisdom and spirituality. She advised and counseled kings as well as peasants, most notably Cademan, the abbey herdsman who at her training and encouragement would become the first known English poet. In 664 her convent was chosen as the site of the first English synod. Bede, the great historian of the conversion of the Anglo-Saxons, wrote of Hilda, all who knew her called her mother. She died on November 17th in AD 680. Let us pray. O God of peace, by whose grace the Abbess Hilda was endowed with gifts of justice, prudence, and strength, to rule as a wise mother over the nuns and monks of her household, and to become a trusted and reconciling friend to the leaders of the church, give us the grace to recognize and accept the varied gifts you bestow on men and women, that our common life may be enriched and your gracious will be done. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Amen.